Access. I'm Colin West. This is your official Luck of the Draw free show. This Saturday, coming to you live on UWAElite.com, Luck of the Draw, where we will crown a brand new UWA Elite Champion. If you're not here in South Harbor, New Jersey, you're obviously going to miss a great show. Fans are filing in right now, but that's okay. You can catch us again next month when UWA Elite and its brand new champion present When Worlds Collide. But for now, let's head to the ring for our special pre-show match. Fans, you know it's a huge, huge night at UWA Elite when the prestigious Trios Championships are the pre-show match. Ladies and gentlemen, after an outstanding debut last month here at UWA Elite, coming within a hair's breadth of winning the UWA Elite Trios Championships and ending the undefeated reign of Kentucky bred, UWA Elite President Dave Swan, by massive request of our fan base, has brought these three men back. Raymond Risk, Chris Cade, and Maximo Suave. It's defiance. Well, take one. These guys were so impressive at dangerous uprisings. Here come the undefeated ones. Swan, you were saying about the impressive showing of Defiance in their opening match at Dangerous Uprisings. Yeah, they definitely more than proved that they deserve this championship match here on All Access. Absolutely. And I was saying, Dave, before you sat down, how huge of a show is it that the prestigious Trios Championships held by the undefeated tandem of Kentucky Bread are on the pre-show? of this huge super coin. Yeah, absolutely. What an event it's going to be. Luck of the draw this Saturday night on UWALE.com. But I'll tell you what, right here on All Access, it is a huge, huge match coming up for the Trios Championship. Wow. Unbelievable. Georgie Boy, Luke Finn, Clay Sawyer. You may love them. You probably hate him, but one thing that nobody has been able to do is beat him. And you look at those beautiful UWA Elite Trios Championship belts. Signifying the UWA Elite Trios Championships. One of the rare Trios Championships available in a United States promotion. I'm telling you what, two of the premier East Coast, if not North American trios teams on the scene right now. Defiance, Kentucky Bread, about to hook it up one more time, live on All Access. This is the Luck of the Draw pre-show. Referee Ryan T about to give the signal, and away we go. Looking like Clay Sawyer will start things out against Chris Caden. I, I, I think. Yeah. You never know. And there's the bell. Fans already hyped, and it's just the pre-show for Luck of the Draw, but so much on the line. The first of three UWA Elite Championships to be decided at Luck of the Draw and the Luck of the Draw pre-show. This Saturday. Three, two, one. Watch. Hey, wait, nothing crazy, watch. I don't know if this is a good idea. Well, no 
Nobody accused Clay Sawyer of being the brightest bulb in the drawer. I've never seen a Southern mime before, but I think we just saw it happen. Teddy just looks just like him. Uh, like I said, Clay Sawyer, not the brightest bulb, but he does love him some rebel lifestyle. Oh, man. The Redneck Millionaires, as they call themselves. Kentucky Bread, undefeated in their lead-up to and undefeated in every defense of the UWA Elite Trios Championships. But I would have to say, this is the sternest test to Kentucky Bread's Trios Championships thus far. The difference? Defiance came within a whisker of defeating them last month at Dangerous Uprisings, and Dave, they've had a month to scout the men they almost beat. Oh, huge kick to the chest, followed by a neck breaker, and just like that, Defiance gains the advantage. Georgie Boy in to break up the pin. Fans, if you love this UWA Elite action, tune back in to UWA Elite. Dot com this Saturday night for the first ever UWA Elite Luck of the Draw Tournament where we will crown a new UWA Elite Champion and the fans in attendance will determine every first round contest. Plus, Kyle the Beast defends my championship against Sean Damage McNellis in a number one contenders match. And very interesting, during that match, I am told we will be joined live on commentary by Drake Chambers. Not a match to miss, but right now, eyes on everything as Kentucky Bred, the way they usually do, two and three on one antics, Kentucky Bread seizes the advantage. And here's a roll through suplex. And this is the interesting thing about Kentucky Bread. As you see Luke Finn in there, came in as mashers, maulers, and brawlers, but they seem to have upped their technical game as a unit over the months that they have been Trio's champions, Dave. Yeah, well, they've definitely gotten much more cohesive as a unit. Their game has gotten a lot tighter, and you know what? They're looking impressive as a team. Very true, and there, as if by magic, fantastic proof of such a thing. Now, Defiance in a one-on-three position. Oh! My goodness! You're kidding me. Matt kicked out of two. I don't know how in the world he kicked out of that. Double vertical suplex to a knee drop. Rode it all the way down. Gorgeous three-on-one maneuver by Kentucky Bread. Georgie Boy in there now. Just keeps shoving him into that buckle. And Georgie Boy, easily, easily the, the mauler of Kentucky Bread. Doesn't know much about that there technical wrestling, Dave, but no. he will punch you in the mouth as many times as it takes. Say what you want about Kentucky Bread. You may say, oh, they're not great technical wrestlers. They're not this, they're not that. Let me run down. And again, their ability to gain a three-on-one triple drop kick. A three-on-one advantage is unparalleled in UWA Elite right now. I'll tell you what, Georgie Boy coming up a little bit lame on the outside. Looks like he may have tweaked his knee a little bit. Oh. Nice uppercut there by Sawyer. That may play into the finish of the match, but right now it doesn't much matter if Georgie Boy only has one leg because Kentucky Bread is very, very much in control. So confident, Luke Finn takes a moment to drink some moonshine on the outside of the ring. Oh, modified Brain Buster suplex. Sawyer into the cover. Two. Ooh, Suave had to break up the count. But crowd here desperately, desperately wants to get behind Defiance, but in the last few minutes, they haven't had much of a reason to. Here's a reversal, though. Clay Sawyer going up top. Why? Oh! Went for it all and got none of it. This could be the opportunity they needed. Nope. Into the buckle. 
Clay Sawyer looking for a belly to back. Flip over. Oh, knee right to the gut. Oh, oh, flying reverse cutter. Both men down, center of the ring. Turning point of the matchup. Referee Ryan T's count at two. Anybody's ball game right now. Both men rolling to the corner. He's getting there. Chris Caden begging the fans to get behind Defiance. Sawyer to the corner. Tags Luke Finn. Tags Lobby. Here we go. Ducks the line. Ducks the line. Kick to the gut. Slap to the back. Backstabber. Clay Sawyer now in illegally. Double chop to the back. Whips him off the ropes. Reversal. Clay Sawyer in. Manhattan drop. Oh, take it out that way. Maneuver. Now Georgie Boy into the ring. Ah, clears the ring of Chris Caden. Now, we got one assault. Georgie Boy into the corner. Huge modified cannibal in the corner. Huge modified shoulder. Oh! And Siguri super kick combination. Now, Clay Sawyer into the power slam on Chris Caden. Georgie Boy spills to the outside, goes for the Enziguri, ducks, super kick! Oh, super kick caught, swung around, knee into the gut, pump handle by Luke Finn. Action so fast I can barely call it. It's a shame I'm so damn good at my job. Defiance off the ropes, oh, running knee strike. Do we have a one, two, new, new, new! UWA Elite Tag Trios Champions! I can barely believe what I've seen for the first time since the summer of 2014 in their debut. Kentucky Bread has been defeated. Defiance are your new UWA Elite Trios, champions of the world. For Dave Swan, I'm Colin West. Congratulations to Defiance. This has been the All Access Luck of the Draw pre show. We will see you live Saturday night on UWAElite.com for Luck of the Draw.